And as Tony just mentioned, the accumulating snow is expected to wind down within the next few hours. Many spending today inside, away from the storm, while others decided to embrace yet another taste of winter. Iowa News News reporter Steve Nielsen kicks off our severe weather coverage now with a look at things in the capital city. Steve. Well, guys, what a difference 30 minutes makes. We were just on air live at 6 o'clock over on WPRI 12. The snow and the wind still whipping into our face. And now the snow is pretty much stopped here right now. The only snow we see is the snow that's blowing off of the ground from the wind right now. The gusts have stopped quite a bit. And if you can see the road in front of me here, plows have been able to keep up pretty well. I mean, considering how much snowfall we've had here, these streets look great, and National Grid has been working hard in downtown Providence to try to keep the lights on. Despite the flurries in the air, downtown Providence was a flurry of activity Tuesday. We witnessed plow trucks struggling to make it up hills, and electricity was knocked out to east side homes for a while. National Grid crews here near Thayer Street said snow caked lines slapped together. Then we called National Grid ourselves after seeing this utility pole swaying in the gusty wind. After our call, crews showed up to inspect it and shore it up. They said they can't replace it until the wind dies down. That's pretty crazy. <laughs> yeah, let's go, let's go sledding. Let's get away from that. Speaking of sledding, was that awesome or what? <laughs> yes. Henry Spencer's mom brought him to this hill to try to make the snow day fun. So I've never been sledding. Do you have any advice for me? To try to go on a little hill before you go on a big one. Okay, so I got to work my way up to the big one. Is this a big one? This is a pretty big one. Yeah. But he said the snow is a little too dry for sledding. The sled on this kind of snow, it really slips. So he wanted to show me how to sled without a sled. Put your head down. Okay. Put your hands back. Put my hands back? Like this. Oh boy. I think I'm too big to do the penguin. It's not working. I'm going too slow. I still need some work. I am so happy we could document how terrible I am at sledding that that will live on forever now. Um, I did want to tell you though, Henry's story, because I mean, I just think that that is so great that on a day like this, so many of us just want to be inside, wish it wasn't happening, dreaming of summer. There's still kids out there that are just having an absolute great time sledding and enjoying winter right now. So just keep that in mind when you complain about this snow. Reporting live in downtown Providence, I'm Steve Nielsen, Eyewitness News.